Hey guys, it's Daniel. The following is from an interview Jim Morrison did with journalist John Tobler in August of 1970, one year after Woodstock. John Tobler says to Jim that some people he spoke to who were at Woodstock said it was actually terrible. Quote, When I talked to some cats who came back from Woodstock, like Clive Selwood, he said it was terrible. You know, the sheer inability to cope with the multitudes, and now they've made it a film, and everyone's saying, wow, beautiful revolution. End quote. In response, Jim said the following, quote, I'm sure that these things get highly romanticized, but I was kind of of that opinion myself when I saw the film. It seemed like a bunch of young parasites being kind of spoon-fed this three or four days of, well, you know what I mean. They look like victims and dupes of a culture rather than anything. But I think that may have been sour grapes because I wasn't there, not even as a spectator. So I think that even though they are a mess and even though they are not what they pretend to be, some free celebration of a young culture, it's still better than nothing. And I'm sure that some of the people will take away a kind of myth back to the city with them and it'll affect them. End quote. John Tobler then asked Jim, I take it that you don't believe in this sudden miraculous revolution that's being spoken about. Jim then says the following, quote, That would be unreal to me. I don't want to say too much because I haven't studied politics that much really. It just seems that you have to be in a constant state of revolution or you're dead. There always has to be revolution. It has to be a constant thing, not something that's going to change times and that's it, you know. The revolution is going to solve everything. It has to be every day.